this hot rod for Chris Marshall is about to go up against the Bartone Brothers Racing outfit with Sean Bellamy and you <laughs> snookered low ET of that last session with a 541 from that car. I sure did. I uh, just everybody did a great job. Bob Miner builds great engines. Greg's tuning the car. He made the right calls right on the starting line. Got in the box and I go, oh boy, hold on. And it was a great ride. The top alcohol competitors here at the NHRA Nevada Nationals did not hit the track on Sunday until after the pro categories contesting their semi-final action. For top alcohol funny car, they wrapped up their round one of eliminations, which was postponed Saturday night due to high winds and dust here in Las Vegas. Those that advanced out of round one into round two with the floppers are Annie Whiteley, number one qualifier who had a buy run, Bob McCosh. Chris Marshall, Jim Whiteley, Shane Westerfield, and also the 2023 world champion, Doug Gordon, including Sean Bellamere. Well, she certainly is being a wonder woman here in Las Vegas. Kim Parker here in the semifinals about to run here at the Nevada Nationals. She took out the event defending winner in Madison Payne. Good day so far. Oh, very good day so far. I've had to do my job and focus, but we, we came out ahead. So hopefully two more rounds to go. Thank you for doing good burnouts in an injected nitro car. I didn't know it could be done. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, we've, I've always done huge burnouts, and I told Randy, you're going to have to tune around it. I'm going to do a big burnout, like it or not. And he said, okay. <laughs> The Dragsters picked up their action Sunday with round two of eliminations. Kim Parker defeated Madison Payne, the defending event winner here for the NHRA Nevada Nationals. Joey Severance moves on to the semifinals. Sean Cowie and Jackie Frick defeated Julie Natus, the 2023 world champion in top alcohol dragster competition. Now, you see from the interviews that there was the intent from the NHRA to get more rounds of eliminations completed Sunday evening, but that did not occur. The track was lost due to the cooling temperatures here in the Las Vegas area, and they deemed it unsafe to continue competition. They will pick up competition for the sportsman categories, including the top alcohol competitors, Monday here at the Strip at Las Vegas Motor Speedway around 9.30 a.m. We'll be here to continue coverage. I'm Lee Kraft, a.k.a. the Monday Morning Racer, with this top alcohol report brought to you by McKinney Corp.